Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to the series on common sense. Today we're going to be discussing uh, what's the purpose or the point of a protection dog. And we're talking Rottweilers, Dobermans, Pit Bulls, uh, Presa Canarios, Can Connie Corsos, uh, Fila Masters, Napoleon Masters, French Masters. Uh, <clears throat> list goes on and on. Belgian Malinois. Why did you... Why did that light bulb go off in your head and you say, man, I want one of these dog breeds for protection? Rule number one. The, the dog is not there to protect you. Let's uh, put an X on that. Is there to assist you in the event you need help. Uh, my pressers... Will, will defend me I already know this but that's not their objective here uh, they watch over they guard property they do all of that stuff right I'm the first line of defense you know Mr. 10 millimeter Mr. 44 Magnum Mr. M16 that's the first line of defense my presses are my secondary line assisting defense makes sense what I mean when I'm saying this is, uh, you don't get a dog of this, a Rottweiler presser of, of that level with the intentions of the dog supposed to do all the thinking and acting for you, the human. You're you messing up already. Um, we're going to discuss the differences between males and females. I own four pressers at one time. Four. Ain't that right? Come here, shotgun. Come here, girl. That is girl. Uh, the females. <laughs> Come on. Get up here. Get in the camera. Come on. Uh, Come give me a hug. There you go. Not on my glasses, because I can't see if you do that. Three o'clock in the morning. I'm out here with the presses. But this is Iron Gate Kennels. This is Cowboy. I got puppies on the way. Enough. Get down. Down. Enough of it. Damn, she's heavy. But uh, we're going to discuss all of this from feeding to uh, training. I've been training dogs for 30 years. I'm here to help. I'm going to tell you this. Uh, we're going to end it on this note. Cheap. Stop being cheap. A free presser, a $300 presser, a $500 presser, $600 presser, $800 presser. Watch out for that crap. And don't call me with that because there ain't no presser over here cheap like that. I'm being honest with you. you. You get what you pay for. But will they protect you? Will they guard you? What you think? What you think? Always by my side. Always watching. We're gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go into characteristics of presses. Uh, what it's like living with presses. I got four presses in my master bedroom, and I showed y'all up yonder is their building. You know, in the daytime, that's where they go. I might have. I'm always gonna have one around me. One or two around me, and sometimes all four out. But uh, this is Iron Gate Kennels. This your boy Cowboy. Two five six eight four eight four four five seven. Even if you don't buy a dog from me, call me for training. Uh, salute to my big homie, uh, P Don. I've been training dogs for thirty years. He's been doing it for forty. He got a ten year spread on me. You know, and he ain't cheap. Stop going to PetSmart with a uh, working dog talking about you getting it trained. You're wasting your time, money, and screwing up the dog possibly. This is Cowboy Iron Gate Kennels. Bark back at me. See you on the next episode.